part two. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, so where we left off was, because I know sometimes I can be watching an episode and be like, what happened in the last episode? We stopped with Previously. Reggie sharing mm -hmm. that he had a stretch goal at the conference and he said, okay, I want to have a house by December 2021. While we didn't get the house in December of 2021, we shown up went under contract, honey, in February of 2022. But here's what happened though. So Oh, we got to Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, wait. Sorry. Babe, yeah. Sorry, jumping. I'm jumping. Babe. All right, so listen. So in Let's December Let's tell the story about how we found out. Yes. So okay. in December, December rolls around, right? And obviously we're not under contract, right? When I'm right. home, but it's okay. Yeah. Because the thing is when we set that goal, we were super locked in. Like we prayed about it. We knew what we wanted. And we was just like, you know what? We're just going to, and this is important. And I want like everybody to understand this. When you know what it is that you want and, and God has placed on your heart, like this is it. Yeah. Or, or this is what, um, this is yours. Mm -hmm. Like in the waiting process, like prepare, pray yeah. and prepare. That's a good like, Cause just sitting there and not doing anything and just saying, God, this is what I want. And just sitting there and just, God is not just want to give it to you and you're not taking the action steps or the faith steps. Yep. So our faith steps was we like, yo, we need to save up. Yep. Like, so we we need to our save monkeys. up because when the opportunity presents itself, we need to be ready to jump. Yeah. So December rolled around and it was just a random day. In January. Was it January? Th December. I feel like it was December when we found out. No, I think it was January because it was it was two weeks before we did the sign up and all that. Stuff. Okay, so it was January. Yeah. All right. So, um, so it was January, and I'm at work, right? And so because I'm in real estate, I get a ton of emails, marketing from like builders and people trying to sell properties or whatever. Hey, do you know anyone that's looking to buy this, 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 or that, or whatever? Guess who ends up sending me an email saying, yo, we're building a second phase in this neighborhood. It was the neighborhood that we wanted to be. The builders for our neighborhood, they were like, hey, phase two's <laughs> coming. And I'm like, we're looking at And I said, we're oh, like, zooming in I'm on looking. the email. <laughs> and I'm like, let me email this over to Jasmine. And Jasmine was like, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was like, shut up. And I was like, zooming in. I'm like, is this? Is I know, this real? Fine print and Are we sure? It was a neighborhood that we wanted to be in. And we told y'all that we had a list of everything that we wanted and it being a new build and new construction was the thing that was missing yeah. initially. Yep. And sure enough, in that month, we got a random Crazy. email. We are building a second phase. I think it was like, this is the moment you've been waiting for. I'm like, shoot. I mean, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, so we crazy. got that news. That was like... And what happened next? That was incredible. I still get like butterflies, chills just thinking about it because it was just like so out of nowhere. It was crazy, yeah. And it was... He was one of the <clears throat> first to know about it because he's a realtor and it wasn't blasted out to the public yet. Mm -hmm. So at this point, I'm emailing... I was like... I told Reggie, I was like, you know what? They didn't have a reply, bla reply back email, but I'm going to reply back and be like, Thanks Jasmine. so much. Can't wait. I was like, because I want to get in with these people, whoever is running this show. I want them to know who I am. Yes, I am Jasmine Jones. Hello. Yeah. I'm like, Jasmine, work your magic because Jasmine is super bubbly. She know how to. So Honey, I'm like. Every, I'm not kidding. Every email they sent out leading up to the meeting to talk through, okay, what did we want in the house? Mm -hmm. If we were to potentially buy, whatever. Every single email they sent yeah. out, I would always reply and be like, can't wait to set an appointment with you yep. guys. Thank you so much. Like I was just, cause I wanted them to know my email. And sure enough, that's why I got in tight with the sales girl. Can I stop us right here real quick? Cause I just thought about something. What? We can't forget about the part where we discovered the lake in the neighborhood. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, y'all. You're gonna, you're gonna <laughs> be like, so these people aren't crazy. Y'all may not get every single detail, but. Sorry, we just don't wanna leave anything out because there's so many little God <clears throat> moments. Okay. Backtrack before we got the email. Yes. Or no, no, we got the email. By this time? No, I don't even think we got the email yet. I think we were still driving around in the neighborhood. Yeah, it was before. It was way before we got the email. Are you sure? I promise. 
I know. No, no, no. Okay, okay, well. Okay, anyways, we're just backtracking like a snitch, like earlier that month, before we got the email. I feel like it was way before that, but anyway. No, because it was when we had COVID, and we had COVID in January. Or when I had COVID, you had COVID, whoever. I had COVID. Okay, well, anyways. anyway. <laughs> anyways. Anyways, so backtrack a little bit. What happened was, basically, we were, we there's a lake in our neighborhood, and we were walking around there, and we saw we the, didn't know we didn't th this is when we didn't know that oh was lake. right okay yeah so we were walking through the neighborhood and we were like yo is that a lake like that's a lake and we walked over this is early this this is why i say this is way before okay we maybe went. you should tell because i'm confused on what part we're talking so about. anyway so let's go way back like this was earlier this is like before we even got the email or whatever we're in the neighborhood i remember it was overcast everything we're walking through the neighborhood Oh, yeah, but it wasn't that early. Okay, whatever it was. <laughs> so, anyway, we're walking in the neighborhood, and then we see, like, a trail, and we're like, oh, snap, they got a trail, and then we see a lake. Yo, this is tough. Like, they got a, a, a lake, they got a trail, and we're walking on that trail, and we both were just like, yo, imagine if we end up moving here. Like, imagine if we was able to move here. Okay, we're talking about different things. But okay, that yeah, that's cute. That's nice. The part that I was talking about was right before or right after we got the email. That's the separate part, yeah. We saw that they were breaking ground on a little area over near the lake. So that we were thinking that was our new part phase two of the neighborhood. So we're yeah. like, we're gonna move here. Actually, I'm gonna find the video and I'm gonna put it in here so that you guys can watch it or whatever. Yeah, we was out there like, and we were like, "What? It, we're gonna live over here one day? All this stuff." Nothing there yet. But our house is coming. Mm. <laughs> uh, not even knowing that, like, if you drive like a little bit farther down, th that's actually where they were breaking ground and building base too. So, anyways, we get the email. We get a design appointment stat as soon as they came out because it's, it was, I mean, this was early 2022. So like the market was pretty cutthroat. It was like cutthroat. But anyways, so we made a design appointment. It's kind of bizarre, but basically they, you do a design, a virtual design appointment to pick, to, to pick out all of your fixtures, your lights, your tile, your this, your that, what package you want. Do you want a screen and porch? Do you not want one? All that stuff before you're even able to go under contract. So I'm like, okay, fair enough. I don't even know what the, we don't know what the numbers are. We're going into this meeting. We're like, Lord Jesus, we feel like it's going to be mad expensive, but we're just going to go into it. We knew what the base, just we, knew what the base we knew what the base was. Right. But And we were comfortable with the base, but yeah. it was like, how yeah. much is it with all the stuff we want though? My job, listen, like just being real y'all, like, and this is why you really got to be led. But we, at this point, like financially, we were doing pretty well. But and had a good savings, but yes, but we didn't feel we completely comfortable. Like, okay, we bought this house, we got this cushion, like we good. We could not have we afford not, it comfortably. Like no. it'd be tight, tight, real tight. Yeah. So we were going into your like, we'll see what happens. Yeah. Reggie was super skeptical. He was like, "Ain't no way they're gonna get these numbers right for us to move in." So. Tell them about what happens when we do the whole design meeting, how you felt after. Yeah, so going into it, I'm like, yo, okay, God, like if this is supposed to happen for us, it'll happen if it's meant for us or whatever. Um, and so I went in and I'm like, yo, I got these questions I'm gonna ask, she better get them right. <laughs> yeah. She better be on point with the numbers, yeah. blah, 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 blah. But when we went in, she's asking and I'm like, Jasmine, I told Jasmine before we went in, I'm like, Jasmine, get everything, like add everything that you want. And I was like, everything? Yes, like everything. And he was like, like everything. Fireplace, like, screened in porch, all of that. Like okay. add everything that it is that you want. Yep. And then we'll see what it is at the end. And then we'll make a decision from there. And I just felt like, okay, we wouldn't get this far and God wouldn't lead us this far. And then we just do it halfway, mm -hmm. you know? So it was like, yo, go all the way. And that's what we did. And by the end of it, she let us know what the numbers was. And 
I think we both were just like, wait. Huh? We're like, are you sure? And, you, and we were That's like everything. itemized everything that we wanted. And it was yep. like, that was the number. And yes. we were like, hmm. And we both we walked away feeling good about it. Might be able to work with that. Yeah. Now, the battle's <laughs> not over. Like, don't get it twisted. Again, I told you the market was berserk. So we got past that. Now, there was this one day where you had to do what's called a sign up. This is not typical. This is okay. So like, yeah. I'm just letting you know this is in funny. a normal market, oh this is goodness. not typical for new construction. New construction, you typically go pick your lot, pick your fixtures. Cute. You got the house in this market. Yeah. There was a sign up first come first serve. It was out of pocket in yeah. our little thing. There were four homes mm -hmm. available. Four okay? spots. One, two, three, four, yeah. four. Okay. On top of that, <laughs> The price went up by $2,000 every time someone signed up. So basically, if you were the fourth slot, then it was two, four, six, eight, eight thousand $8,000 more than whatever, mm -hmm. whatever. So just keep that in mind. So it was on a, I remember it was on a Saturday. I don't know the exact day, but it was on a Saturday at 10 a.m. So we were ready. Reggie and I had both of our computers. We were like, let's freaking go. Okay, you wanna tell them? Cause you think no, it's funny. Them, <laughs> okay. It's hilarious. Okay, so. We're like, let's go. We were ready. We we were prayed up. I even did. When I say prayed up, I, <laughs> honey, I, I felt like we were doing like Black yeah. Friday shopping or something crazy. And we so, was locked in. So yeah. then, locked in. Nine fifty nine, ten a.m. hits. We're like, go. Let's go. Two separate computers. Jasmine is over there in the <laughs> cut. I'm over here. We locked in. And, and we're waiting. We're like, where the freak is this email? Was it nine a.m.? 10 a.m. So it was so 10 a.m. So and we were waiting. Then it hits like 10.01 and it's like, yo, no, like, even, what is going I'm on? Like, oh my God. And then it probably was like 10.02 when Jasmine's like, okay, I'm in. I got the email. I got the email. So I got the you email. have to type in your name, your first and last name, your current address, and the specific house type. Mind that you, you want. I'm over here and I'm like, where's the freaking email? I didn't receive one, but you over there, you got one. So Jasmine is over there and I'm just like, in my mind, I'm like, it's yeah. on jazz. Yeah, you gotta have mama mentality right now, Jazz. Mama right. mentality. Yeah, you gotta be I had to put on my 24 jersey. I was like, I'm like, Jazz, you gotta be clutch this. right now. And sure enough, like she's going over there going crazy. And then what happened? Like you you got in and then you got kicked out. It kicked me out. Because it was so many people trying to get oh, into those four spots. Yeah. Like so many people uh, yes. that kicked Jasmine out and Jasmine starts <laughs> panicking. Oh my god, they got get kicked out. <laughs> and I'm like, and I was I'm like, like I'm there. so sorry. I'm over so here trying to cheer her on, and I'm like, Jazz, it's okay. Like, trying to keep her calm, yeah. like a husband should do. And she's like, okay, okay. Like, well, she's like about to cry. I literally had a tear. Literally had a tear. It but, was. But she was able to get back in. Dress. And then I got back in. We got the fourth spot, y'all. The last spot, y'all. The last spot. Oh, my God. Four spots. We got the fourth one. We literally got kicked out, was able to get back in and get the fourth spot. But what's so funny is the achiever in me, because we didn't get number one, I was like, I, yo, I'm sorry, I just, I Jasmine got was number over four. Here, and I'm like. <laughs> and he's like, Jasmine, we literally got in, we got the house. And I was like, and my oh view, yeah. like, everybody had to, everybody, everybody else had to wait like six months. Yes. And six months, like you go six months from then, like you had to pay that much more. Like you had to yeah. pay a lot more money. Yeah. But we got in. We we literally got in. And so we went under contract that next week. And we were just like, we were so over the moon. Like after we got in, we actually, Reggie was so sweet and had a trip planned for us to go to Wilmington, like for a day trip. And we went to the beach and we had dinner. Yeah, and it was, it was process. perfect. It was perfect timing too, because it was also Valentine's day the next day. So it was just like, it was really, really sweet memories. And we're just so grateful that God was faithful and that we got in and like, man, if that ain't God, that we got in like on the fourth spot. Listen. Crazy. Listen, it was obviously like on our part, what we had control over yeah. was preparing for the opportunity. Like mm -hmm. we saved up. I mean, you know, make sure our credit was right. Every, like top notch, like all of that. But the way everything came together, like only God could do something like that for real. Absolutely. Like, it was just, it was mind blowing. The way it was, it, it was super mind blowing. Okay. We might have to do part three. <laughs> I didn't realize this part story three, was so yeah. long, but we really wanted to like 
really give you guys a picture of every single detail so that you could understand like God's faithfulness. Yes, on because a large scale. it doesn't, even when we went under contract, there, like, we still <laughs> were not <laughs> in a position, where, like, it was like, yeah, well, okay, saying. we'll do it and then we'll figure it out later because this is our strong. And when I say we was like, yo, we'll figure it out after. <laughs> yes. And we were, we were even, let me just say this really quick before we close out. Mm. The week leading up to going under contract, we still weren't even sure if we were going to follow through with it because mm. we literally, it was tight. Like we could afford it, but like, it was like just there. Like I, it wasn't a lot of cushion to save, to have extra money left over, all this stuff. So we were like, we were talking yeah. to wise counsel. We were like, what do we do? I don't know. We felt led to move forward with it, but we were scared. Like we'll, we were, we'll talk about we it in scared. the next video. Because we'll talk about it. I yeah. was literally this close to being like, nah. I know. I know. So anyways, we'll, we'll talk, talk about the next about video. Yep. Stay tuned for part three. Sorry to leave y'all hanging. We just don't want to make it too long. We love you guys so much. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and we'll see you in the next right, video, part three. Bye.